let's get doodle, Loki doodle. Find out what you want to know. Let's all go. live underwater? And why do birds live in trees? I don't live in trees, and I don't live underwater. So this must be the place for a monster that looks like me. But why? Hmm. When you need to know, go to Okido! <laughs> Zoe. Hello, Felix. Hi, Hello, Missy. Missy. What are you doing? We're painting the house. Why? You have to take care of the place you live in, Missy. Zoe, that's a cloud chip emergency alarm. <gasps> Zim, Zam and Zoom must be in trouble. Uh, hello? Zoe? Felix? It's Zam. Is everything all right? No. Zim spilt orange juice on the cloud ship's controls. Someone was driving upside down. And we can't control where the cloud ship's taking us. It's as if it has a mind of its own. Uh, but where are you? We're in the mountains. But not for long. Now the cloud ship's taking us to... Where are we going, Zam? It looks like we're going to the North Pole. <gasps> Bring some warm clothes. The North Pole is freezing. To the North Pole, Missy! <laughs> Let's get doodle, Loki doodle! <laughs> I'm very cold. Oh, I'm freezing. Oh, aren't you cold, Missy? Only a little. My toes are icy. Have you got another pair of woolly socks, Felix? You've eaten the last pair, Messy. <laughs> Oops. Oh, where is the cloud ship? Where is Zim, Zam and Zoom? <laughs> Did someone say Zim? Zim! Zim! Hello, you three. Uh, why are you pretending to be a snowman, Zim? <laughs> I, I got out of the cloud ship for just a second. Zam couldn't stop it flying off and, and I ended up... Stuck here in the snow. Uh, here, have some earmuffs. Thanks, Felix. <gasps> What's that? We're near the North Pole, so I'd, I'd say it was a p polar bear. Do you have a scarf in your bag for the polar bear, Felix? It must be cold. <laughs> I don't think polar bears need clothes, Messy. Felix is right, Messy. Why do you think polar bears are furry? Uh, because. Fur keeps them warm in the North Pole? Yes, exactly. The thick hairs of their fur keep warm air in and keep cold air out. Uh, and it's white, so they can blend in with the snow. So I'm not as cold as Zoe and Felix because I'm furry? Yes, it's too cold for Zoe and Felix in this snowy habitat. This what it at? Habitat. A habitat is a place where something lives. You see... Hello? Uh, it's Zam. Can you hear me? Zam, where are you? Are you all right? The cloud ships brought me to the desert, to Scorchy Hot Hill. That's the hottest place in Okido. Don't panic, Zam. We're on our way. I'm hot. I'm thirsty. I'm hungry. And hot. And thirsty. 
This hot desert isn't the best place to be furry like you, Messy, because all that fur will make you even hotter. We need to find some shade and drink some water before we can make a plan. Come on! <sighs> That's better. Can anyone see the cloud ship? I can't. Let's ask this funny polar bear if it's seen it. This thirsty thing isn't a polar bear. It's an okido camel. Polar bears would be too hot if they lived here in the desert. Camels can drink as much as 300 cups of water in one go. They store the water up for when there's nothing to drink for days and days. Hello, it's Zam. Zam, where are you? I'm under the sea. I still can't control the cloud ship. It's going wherever it wants. Oh, no. Come quick. We're just going deeper and deeper. <laughs> Hello, Sam. Can you hear us? Still no answer. Oh, the cloud ship must be very deep. I think if we're going to find Sam, We'll have to go down a long way. <gasps> deeper, 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 deeper! It's getting really dark. The sunlight can't get past all this giant seaweed. I can't see anything. How will we ever see which way to go now? <gasps> oh, hello. Wow! Zim, what is it? Hmm. At this depth, in this dark, with those eyes, there's only one thing it can be. A spookfish. Hmm. We've seen animals that live in cold habitats. They have fur like me, to keep them warm. And we've seen animals that live in hot habitats. This fish lives in a dark habitat. Her eyes help her to see in dark places. <laughs> I think she wants us to follow her. Maybe she knows where the cloud ship is. All right. Let's follow the fish. Sam, are you there? The Zooey, I'm still deep in the sea. Where are you? We're deep in the sea, too. We're in the dock. And... Oh. Well, we've just bumped into something. Something's just bumped into the cloud ship. It's Sam. Oh, I'm so glad you're here. How did you find me in the dark? A spookfish led us to you. Her eyes are perfect for this dark habitat. Thank, Thank you, you spookfish. spookfish. The good news is I've managed to make the cloud ship stop. Oh, good. The bad news is, now it won't move. Oh, dear. Perhaps there's something in this habitat we can use to help us. Yes, let's ask the spooky fish to fix the controls. <laughs> I don't think so, Messy. But habitat is a word for the plants, the weather and the animals all together in one special place. There must be something here. The seaweed! Oh, yes! Let's eat the seaweed! No, Messy! We can use it to tie the cloud ship and Okie Doodle together! So that Okie Doodle can pull the cloud ship back to the tower! Yes! Good one, Zoe! <laughs> what a great idea! <laughs> you three. We couldn't have got home without you. 
Well, I've been all over Okido today, to the North Pole, to the desert, and under the sea. But after a long day of travelling, I think it's time I went back to my home. See the sea! We should go home too. Take care, everyone. See you soon. <laughs> Bye! Fish don't live in trees and birds don't live underwater. Fish would need wings and birds would need gills. But messy monsters, well... Messy monsters are right at home in mess. Every part of me is perfect for making it. Mess is my habitat. Ah, lovely mess. Bye-bye.